This is actually a clot of sillimanite surrounded by a moat of cordierite. I just put circles there around the, the sillimanite in the center and the cordierite. The cordierite, low relief, looks a lot like quartz. You cross the polars, has black and white interference, looks a lot like quartz. How do you tell it from quartz? Well, there's, there are two different ways. One is to look at alteration, and another is to look at pleochroic halos. So first I'm going to show you the alteration, then the halos. Here's an example of alteration. In the center of that white circle is what was a large cordierite grain, and it has been altered along uh, fractures so that it's now separated into uh, smaller grains. And so what you'll see is that there are a bunch of grains that are all optically continuous, so they wink in and out uh, at the same time, but they're separated by black areas. The black areas are actually chlorite, and I'll zoom in and show that to you uh, in more detail here. Okay, so here we are zoomed in. I think you can see there's some yellow pleochroic halos, so there's, there's definitely cordierite in here. Um, but then when you cross the polars, there's this black material, um, and that's this... Um, chlorite, variety of chlorite called peninite. Um, so when cordierite has this alteration, it's called peninitization. And it also, it's also characteristic of cordierite, along with the yellow pleochroic halos. The main thing that I look for, though, are yellow pleochroic halos around accessory minerals that have a high uranium content. So these are like the pleochroic halos in biotite, um, except that it's in cordierite and they're yellow. You can see this unusual color. It's mainly the pleochroic halos that I look for. Here you can see bright, bright yellow uh, disappears and as it, as it rotates around you'll see it gets to that dark orangey yellow color. This one is particularly intense. Otherwise, low relief interference colors that are similar to quartz. Well, this section is a little too thick, so it looks yellow. But otherwise, it's a lot like quartz. And here again, the really strong pleochroic halos, uh, dark yellow-orange here. These, like I said, these are about the strongest I've ever seen.